Well, welcome, and thank you uh, for joining us this evening. Uh, my name is Nada St. Germain, and uh, I was introduced to Neolife over 35 years ago. Um, you know, it was interesting because I wasn't looking for supplements, um, but I knew I needed to try something. My mom wasn't well. Um, she was in her 40s, and I was in my 20s, and a neighbor and a dear friend just shared some of the benefits that she was getting after using the Neolive products. Um, she was a flight attendant and uh, we had, I was a police officer. So some of you that, that don't know, and one of the challenges or, or things that we had in common was shift work. And I was just really struggling with fatigue and low energy. And, and so was my mom with their fibromyalgia and a lot of, a lot of aches and pains. And, you know, after using these amazing products, um, the difference in my health in a very short time with energy, hormonal balance, and eventually allergies and joint pain. And I, I have to say that I feel younger in my late 50s than I did when I was in my 20s and 30s. I'm very active physically and uh, the energy is just, just incredible. So I'm so grateful and blessed that a neighbor was uh, was kind enough to share these amazing products with me. And, and you know, I, I like to say that my mom is aging gracefully. And I think that's what we all we all need. And and when we start to to learn about our brain and brain function, nutrition plays such a big role in 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 our brains. And and this is a topic that is very dear to my heart. Some of you know that my dad does have dementia, but it was interesting because it, he didn't get any symptoms or signs until about a couple of years ago. And um, his is a different form. We eventually, through a lot of investigating and a lot of asking questions, and we found out it was from injury, from a brain injury from when he was a boxer as a teenager. Um, and, and, you know, and it was you know, the conversations we've had as a family is, you know, would that have been worse if he wasn't on these amazing products? Because my mom and my dad have been taking good nutrition for 35 years. And for my dad to start getting symptoms in his 80s, we're blessed because I've met families where the symptoms are in their 40s and 50s and they progress very, very quickly. So I really believe that good nutrition can play a really big role in just giving your body the best chance. And that's what we're gonna, gonna be talking about this evening. You know, diet, nutrition, food, and good quality supplements you know, how they can impact your life and, and why and how it plays a critical role in keeping your brain healthy as we age, because that's what we want. So we're going to hear from Dr. Liz Applegate. I have to say, I'm so grateful that, that we've met her and some of you are going are gonna to see her again in, uh, in July um, at, our, at our summit in Texas. And you know what, she's a nationally renowned expert on nutrition and fitness. And she's a fac faculty member um, in the nutrition department and the director of sports nutrition at the University of California at Davies. And she's written numerous articles in Runner's World Magazine. And the reason why um, I like to honor Liz is she has very new to the scientific advisory board and she researched our company to death before she came on board because she was in awe at the quality and the integrity of the company, could not believe that nobody had ever heard of this amazing company. So let's hear a little bit about what Liz has to say about our brain and the importance of good nutrition. I am so thrilled to be joining the group and Cesar and Josh, you guys are just really getting me fired up. I've already been fired up about 2022, but this is a way to really land ourselves here and get on with the year. And I got to say, I'm very impressed with the success stories. And I'm going to bring one of them up. In fact, Jen and uh, John really spoke to some of the topics that I'll be, I'll be addressing. So let's get going with what I'm going to be discussing today. And if we just take a look here, I have been a member of the Scientific Advisory Board, and congratulations, Dr. Beck, you are now the rookie of the board, but hardly a rookie when it comes to superb nutrition experience and scientific background. I've been with the board for five years, going on number six, and I'm always impressed with what Neil Life has to offer. And here is something that I wanna point out that I have, I think, a few times, and that is, 
In my tenure, long stay at UC Davis, um, University of California, Davis, I never got involved in consulting with a nutrition company. And I really was not impressed with what I saw, which was an individual nutrient ap approach, not a whole food approach, not looking at what was in nature, looking at the background science and then coming up with a whole food nutrition supplement. And I'd heard about Neolife, but I thought, well, I'll focus that attention when my load gets a little bit lighter, which is hardly ever. And when I was approached to join uh, as a member of the SAB, I was thrilled, honored, uh, but more impressed as I've come to learn about the tremendous foresight that Neolife has had over all these incredible decades. So, my topic today is one that I've heard many of you allude to, and that is our cognitive health. I want to address a topic that many of us joke about. We say to ourselves, oh, if I could only remember where I fill in the blank, put my keys, I can't come up with that word. I used to be able to add numbers in my head. We have all sorts of our own personal stories about not being as sharp as we used to, maybe having a little bit of fog. Rather than focusing on chronic disease of the brain, Alzheimer's, and other forms of dementia, what I would like to do is to look at this as optimizing, no matter what age we are, look at a way, and do we know through science that we can optimize the health of our brain, the way we think, the way we move numbers around. So first thing is, let's take a look at how does your brain age? During gestation and the first few years of life, you actually add neurons, which are brain cells, and we're, we're, it's growing rapidly. And this is why nutrition during pregnancy and after a child is born is so critical. You can influence the health of the brain, the cognitive skills later in life. We have evidence about what pregnant women eat and the cognitive and IQs of their offspring. During childhood, your brain is busy uh, making neurons, keeping things uh, going and getting bigger. In fact, by age six, and this is why young children seem to have such large heads, uh, that they have 95% of the adult brain weight by age six. Pretty amazing, huh? Well, as we go through our teen years, uh, which may seem like decades ago, I'm sure you remember how obnoxious your parents were then, or if you have teens, they're obnoxious, but the bottom line is teenagers or adolescents don't have the proper wiring in yet. It's still developing. Again, nutrition is critical. Well, we start pruning away some of the neurons and, and um, refining, and by age 22, so in your adult years, Age 22, that's as good as it's going to get, supposedly, for five years. Your top brain power is in those middle 20 years. Then, sadly enough, and this is part of aging, we start to see a decline. And this is a combination of a decline in actual cognitive skills, such as memory, our ability to comprehend uh, in particular, reading comprehension. And by your mid-40s, and I hope I'm not discouraging or depressing some of you, by, by your mid-40s, you actually have, have measurable loss with memory, reading comprehension, and so on. And of course, as this progresses the number of decades, we see physiological changes that we can assess, and that speaks to the brain actually shrinking in volume. Brain cells start to die, and there are brain pathologies that can develop, such as dementia that are characterized by changing uh, in protein. Uh, you get some amyloid, some plaque buildup, as well as some changes in structural component. But I actually am not going to focus on brain disease. I want to address throughout your lifespan to optimize how your brain works. This based on science and looking at what it is that you're eating. So to address the cognitive level issue, I, I wanted to put these two people doing the hula hoop because we poke fun at ourselves. And, and I understand, I'm, I'm certainly not in my mid-20s, 30s, or 40s, 
And I know that I can't find a word that I wanted to use, or I used to be able to stack up 10 different numbers and, and be able to add them in my head. Well, this is showing you the IQ at uh, levels of different type of skill markers, such as numeric ability and what happens over time. And you can see just the only thing really here to look at is the downward trend by the time you get to your mid 40s, we see that numeric ability, verbal memory and recall, spatial ability, all of those things start to decline. What we want to address is can we optimize that? And I did listen to you, Jen, on your success story, and you said you were just kind of in a fog. And a lot of us say that. Uh, we just are not as sharp. And I think you used that word about not feeling clear or alert. And this is an important uh, feeling to have and think about. And I guarantee you that your diet does make a difference when it comes to cognitive health. Well, what I want to do is approach how can we slow brain aging? And we want to go through this as sort of a, a good, better, best. I thought that'd be a fun way to do that. And in chatting with Kendra before we finalize topics, um, she had this idea, and I really think it's a great way to approach it. Good, what should we all be doing in terms of dietary patterns, whole foods, what essential nutrients are key, and Neolife products that can support brain health? Then what's better for us to do? Can we really add to that and get some benefit helping to slow cognitive decline that is inevitable? And then finally, what might be best? Uh, there are some research studies looking at different herbs and compounds shown to further support brain health, such as to enhance the blood vessel flexibility that actually may enhance blood flow and improve your cognitive skills. So let's take a look at a diet pattern. And this is a picture of some beautiful foods. Just look at the rich colors there that we get from the peppers and the greens and some spices. And that, yes, there's seafood in the middle. And if you're like me, you zeroed in on that glass of wine. Yes, that's there too. But notice not more than, than one. Uh, this is a picture of part of the Mediterranean diet, uh, which has been studied for decades in regions of Europe in the Mediterranean region, showing that certain food patterns, eating lots of fruits and vegetables, mostly fish as a protein source, a little bit of wine on a routine basis, using olive oil and so on, has been associated with a variety of different health benefits, or a better way to put it, lower risk of chronic disease. And we typically hear that as reduced risk for, for heart disease, which is true. The DASH diet, dietary approaches to stop hypertension, has to do with, yes, a Mediterranean diet, but even more fruits and vegetables. Just what Dr. Beck was talking about, that the CDC and other assessments of Americans in particular, we fall well short, not just in getting five servings, but nowhere near the 10 servings that might be recommended. Well, research from a variety of different uh, universities around the world, uh, in Israel, but also here in the US, Rush Medical Center has coined a phrase called the MIND diet, Mediterranean DASH intervention for neurodegenerative delay. What this is saying is there is a dietary pattern very close to the Mediterranean diet and the DASH diet that actually has been shown to delay the degenerative workings that go on as we age. <clears throat> and what's recently come about is this notion that there are certain food types, like berries, as you see pictured here, colorful fruits and vegetables, green leafy vegetables, seafood, rich, as Dr. Beck said, in omega-3 fats. In the fall of just this past year, from the Rush uh, Medical Center in Chicago, they actually identified that even in people without brain pathologies, and this is important, everyone, even without signs of losing brain volume or losing ability to recall words, so that we can develop what we call cognitive resiliency 
by eating diets that are rich in antioxidant foods and anti-inflammatory foods. This is like, you know, being touted as very, very important news, and it is, but let me say this, is that Dr. First and the Scientific Advisory Board were well ahead of their time. I actually am awed at how products were developed knowing that it isn't about just vitamin C or about a single antioxidant, but instead it's the synergy of many different compounds. And Dr. First had the insight to this and the Scientific Advisory Board has always kept what is occurring in nature, how is this backed by science? So it's really quite incredible. So let's now take a look at specific foods. What can we do that's, that's good? Well, for starters, the mind diet, one that has berries in it and greens and all that we talked about. But you know, uh, through all my diet counseling, even from uh, superior athletes who eat quite well, I would say, probably better than, than most, um, most individuals, they can't find the time, they don't know how to prepare foods, they aren't consistent. So really bringing products in, in the past, I would encourage people with diet, I still do, but I look to products that Neolife has made as a way to get a foundation of antioxidants and other compounds that can impact brain health. For example, Trey, amazing, ingenious is what I have to say. I did not come up with the formula for this. I was sadly not part of the Neolife board because I would love to pat myself on the back that I had this foresight, but, but uh, Dr. First and some of the earlier members certainly knew the essence of super fruits like pomegranate, acai berry, and green tea, that there are compounds, not just one, not just one essential nutrient, but an array of compounds called polyphenols and polyphenols as antioxidants and other compounds that help support uh, mental agility. And as we know, that in looking at what's in tray, uh, you know, that it's basically a collection of these super fruits. But if you look at as a product, this is what's incredible, standardized delivery. We know what we say is in there is in there. In fact, 20 times the potent polyphenol that's Puna Galligan content is consistent from tray bottle to tray bottle. And this, most companies can, don't even have this product. Uh, we know that it's got quite the number of fold, five to tenfold, I believe, of resveratrol found in, in grapes and other dark colored uh, vegetables and fruits. <clears throat> and also the lycopene and other antioxidants that we find in tomatoes. Tremendous, tremendous product that we have uh, for us to work with. Vegan protein, and thanks Dr. Beck for bringing this up. My, why I wanna tie this back in with brain health is what we're learning. That as we get older, we actually need more protein. But more importantly, during our lifespan, we have a choice between choosing vegan protein, vegetable or plant-based, and animal-based protein. And important research just out this month it's not even collected a speck of dust yet and it's being talked about, is we know that getting a diet that overall is higher in protein, especially for people as we get past the age of 50, which is a lot of people will swear that's the best time of your life, uh, but that by getting more protein, especially eating something at breakfast like a vegan protein pack. So I wanna close out on vegan protein by saying, Again, another point of insight with Neolife, vegan proteins have been shown to have helped lower the odds of subjective cognitive decline and, and also on top of that, getting adequate protein in the diet. So another ingenious development. As Dr. Beck pointed out, omega-3 is very important throughout the lifespan. Women who take it during pregnancy, ch children who get adequate omega-3s as they grow up, have really develop better cognitive skills. And we know that higher omega-3 status is linked to less brain shrinkage as a person gets older. 
So let's take a look just briefly at a few things that have to do with supplementation. That since omega-3s serve as a component of brain cell membranes, we actually have seen that increase with getting more omega-3s in the diet as well as supplementation. This is one of those nutrients through working with people that I have found we just don't get the omega-3s that we need on a consistent basis. Omega-3s also produce cellular mediators that improve the health of your neurons, neuronal health or brain cell health. And finally, we're interested in how can we minimize inflammation as Dr. Speck, Beck spoke about, and I know that John Miller will be addressing, that can lead to brain cell death. So. In comes Neolife Omega-3 Salmon Oil Plus, a, another ingenious invention as far as I'm concerned. I wasn't around for its origination. Uh, at eight different Omega-3s, most Omega-3 supplements look at one or two, and this is an array getting the goodness that comes from cold water fish salmon oil Omega-3s. And this is critical new, newer research that Omega-3 supplementation is shown to significantly improve the co cognitive function. And in the center in the brain, the hippocampus, where we know memory and many other cognitive roles are centered. Well, what can we do better? What can we add on to tray and vegan protein and omega-3s? Well, we can help fill in our gaps and that's exactly what Pro Vitality does, and Neolife T actually addresses the polyphenol story. So you know what's in Pro Vitality. Brain concentrate, carotenoid complex, salmon oil plus, and vitamin and mineral complex. Ingenious to look at how can we best fill in the gaps and provide ourselves with nutrients that will help support many different aspects of your overall health. But in particular, looking at brain function. So those nutrients specifically play a role and have been shown to be associated with better cognitive function. What about Neolife T? Well, this is a product that has a proprietary blend of different teas, white tea, black tea, green teas. And as mentioned earlier, uh, Dr. Beck mentioned a green Mediterranean diet, and this is one in which green tea and an additional load or intake of green leafy vegetables has been shown and just fresh out research showing that it actually has slowed brain atrophy in individuals who do not show signs of Alzheimer's. So these are not individuals who have brain chronic disease, such as a form of dementia. They have just shown that this phenol enriched, which what the Neolife tea is providing, which they provide a different batch or blend of greens and green tea, but polyphenol enriched, so can we say tray, green tea, the Neolife tea has been shown to lessen the atrophy of the brain and this can help long-term in cognitive health. Well, let's finish up with what's best. What can we literally, without putting frosting on it, <laughs> because that's high in sugar and not part of the mind diet pattern, what herbs and other compounds may play a role in mental acuity? Well, coenzyme Q10, lecithin, and mind enhancement complex are three products that Neolife has had out for some time and ingeniously again, play right into that brain health story in many different ways. CoQ10 is an antioxidant. It works in all of your cells to help with the energy release from foods and <laughs> can act as an antioxidant as well. Well, you might say, hmm, and I, I learned this way back when, when I was in graduate school, is that we make CoQ10. That's true. But guess what? We start to slow down as we get older. And I don't mean 110 is getting older. I mean 30s, 40s. And by age 50, 
age 50, we're making 50% of what we had earlier. So it's important to look to a, a source of it uh, to get more in the diet. And this is a naturally sourced product with also polyphenol. What were those? Those important compounds that act as an antioxidant that help develop cognitive resiliency. Lecithin, which we know is a component of um, parts of it as, as brain cells, is another item that we know it plays a key role in, in memory and in, in muscle function as well. And the components of this lecithin, phosphatidylcholine, underlying the word choline, is involved in the transmission of the crosstalk between uh, brain cells and the nervous system, so neurons. So acetylcholine as a neurotransmitter. So this is important role of this nutrient, which let's go back to our earlier years during gestation, after being born, first couple years of life, evidence shows, research evidence that getting choline early in life from food sources like egg yolk or from outside supplemental sources in this natural source can help support healthy brain function and delay some of the onset of cognitive decline. And finally, are there some herbs? We hear lots about this, people taking all sorts of things, even experimenting on their own. Well, the Neolife Scientific Advisory Board turned to worldwide what herbs have been used that science backs up. So we're looking at what's in nature, what does science back up, and there are several herbs found in this mind enhancement complex. And it's a synergistic blend. We know that ginkgo biloba, for example, helps the flexibility of blood flow, the blood vessels into the brain, has been shown to improve mental clarity. Another herb that's in mind enhancement complex is gutu cola, which also has been shown with research to help with cognitive skills. And finally, another one, red sage, uh, the same, with having also polyphenols and enriched antioxidant content to help optimize your mental performance. So rather than thinking of cognitive ability as, oh, I'll worry about that when I'm really old, is we wanna look to how well can we nourish our children, our teenagers, young adults, and ourselves as we go on in life to maximize at any age, optimizing our cognitive health. So thanks so much, all of you, and happy 2022. Let's go in with it with some clear thinking and focus. I just love her. <laughs> Isn't she amazing? She's just a to energize ourselves. Just an amazing speaker. And, uh, you know, when she first joined the, the SAB, the Scientific Advisory Board, I think it's going on to seven or eight years now. Um, we were just so blessed to have her say yes to, to being a part of this Scientific Advisory Board. And you can see and hear her passion when she talks about Neolife and, and how they're whole food based. And that's, that, this is one of the reasons why, as she mentioned, she stayed away from a lot, a lot of other companies because that wasn't their philosophy. And when she saw that Neolife's philosophy was based on whole food, non-GMO for 65 years, like since 1958, she was blown away. And again, this is our scientific advisory board. And, you know, she talks about Do Dr. Susan Beck because she had spoke earlier at this event. Well, you know, we have a team of scientists and doctors that work together in doing research and developing and manufacturing the products. They don't just endorse the product. And Dr. Arthur First was the founder and of our scientific advisory board. He put together the most brilliant minds and, you know, he founded the Stanford Cancer Chemotherapy Laboratory. He was credited with being the founder of chemotherapy and led the Neolife Scientific, scientific Advisory Board for 25 years. PhD in chemistry from Stanford, a doctor of science from the University of San Francisco. He was a diplomat of the Academy of Toxicological Sciences, a distinction that's held by fewer than 100 scientists around the world. Now, he shifted his focus to prevention and ending the trend of chronic disease. He knew that we were struggling with eating enough of the right foods to keep our bodies healthy. 
And I had the opportunity of meeting Dr. Fur several times. This is Mary Ellen. Many of you know her, our, our holistic nutritionist. I found this picture when I was going back in my files and I thought, you guys just, this, this guy's real. Like he hung out with us. He used to come to every single convention and his passion was just, just wanting to impact people's lives and give people the best nutrition to slow aging. World-class research and, the, and partnership we have been published in several peer-reviewed third-party medical journals. And this is really important as well because companies can publish their own findings. And that's really important. So again, based in nature, backed by science, um, you know, for maximum nutrient absorption, utilization, and the best benefits. And that's why people get amazing results. So when you're looking at cognitive function, brain function from children right up as we age, the solution is to keep your mind active, look at omega-3s, super antioxidants, super fruits, and supportive herbs, like Dr. Liz talked about. Now, so she talked about the pro-vitality. This is kind of like your core nutrition. This is the foundation. It contains those grain oils, the fruits and veggies, carotenoids, your omega-3, and a multivitamin. But let's talk about those grain oils. So our grains today are no longer whole. Our grains are milled and processed and the essential lipids are gone. They mill our flour, our wheat, our rice, our soybeans. So our foods have a longer shelf life. So we no longer get these critical oils in our grain anymore. And we're left with this kind of white flour, protein, gluten product with not a lot of nutritional value, but these essential lipids, the only way to get them is from whole grain. And you can grind your own meat, make your own flour, make your own bread. But Neolife was developed in 1958 with this one product called Tranan Grain Concentrate that contains those oils from grain that help to fill the nutritional gaps in our diet. It's difficult to get all these oils in our diet because it's no longer there. So one of these grain oils is like, instead of eating 550 calories of grains, one tran in a day just helps to get your cells healthy. Every single cell in your body. Remember doc, Dr. Liz talked about the trillions of cells, especially brain cells? Well, you're only as healthy as your cells. And the basic function of a healthy cell is to take a nutrients and to eliminate waste. Well, every single cell in your body is surrounded by that lipid layer. So nutrients can get in, waste can get out. And tran and grain concentrate will help your cells work better. And that is why it's in that little uh, vitality pack. So when you're looking at supplements, who do you trust, right? So when you looked at the scientific advisory board, look at the third party publications, did you know that the number one counterfeit nutritional supplement right now is fish oil supplements? People are creating fake fish oils, okay? So when you look at omega-3 and brain health, it supports healthy brain, nervous system, vital for brain development and function, long-term brain health, right? So important that we're taking in a good quality omega-3 fish oil. And Dr. Liz Applegate said it, ultra pure, all eight omega-3s, clinically proven to work, right? It has all eight. Look at that, all eight. And most companies only give you one or two parts of what's found in fish, okay? Then there's our carotenoids, which is your fruits and veggies. She was even saying how we're struggling to reach our 10 or more servings of fruits and vegetables every day. So they put one of these in this pack of Pro Vitality to help you and helps with immunity. And even just one a day is equivalent to eating 80 pounds of raw fruits and vegetables um, in every box. That's the antioxidant power. So when you're looking at that core nutrition, the foundation products, like we talked about, this vitality pack. This is your core nutrition, your grain oil, your fruits and veggies, your omega-3, and a great little multi. And then she recommended a protein, like the vegan protein, or even the Neolife shake. But there's a lot of research on vegan protein and brain function. When you put it together with this vitality pack, we call this a breakfast solution. Then there's our tray. And I have to say that I, I am sipping on a little bit of tray mixed in with our owl. This is not red wine, <laughs> but this is one of my favorite little snacks to have at night, especially when I'm talking to you guys. Um, but it tastes great. It's liquid, liquid nutritional essence of super fruit, fruits. Tastes absolutely amazing. It has all those amazing berries and the pomegranate, acai berry and green tea. And again, 
a lot of research to help with cognitive uh, function, brain function. And then she covered the mind enhancement, increases circulation, stimulates nervous system, and again, increases antioxidant activity. So just a very powerful herb that Neolife has that also supports cognitive health and then our CoQ10. CoQ10, it's great for your heart, but energy, cellular energy. And again, that's why it plays a critical role in the mitochondrial um, energy in, in your cell. So just an, another incredible product to help to support memory. Then lecithin, this is one of my favorites. I've been taking this for many, many years. It's like the communicator. It helps with that messaging from one cell to another. And uh, Dr. Liz talked about how this is a part of our, our, our um, healthy brain program as well. So these are just some of the nutrients that I wanted to share with you this evening. Um, you know, when you're looking at brain function, you got to look at your diet. You got to look at what's missing. Um, and if you're feeling that there's a gap, a nutritional gap, filling the gap is the best solution. And how do you do that? With, with the Neolife Whole Food Supplements, one of the best quality products out there. And I know that they've impacted my life and my family. How do you get these products? It's free to become a member. You register as a member. As soon as you, you register, you automatically get a 10% discount. And guess what? You can get 20% off as well on every order. We can help you do that. There's no gimmicks, no requirements, just savings. And you can even earn your products for free and get your shipping back as well for being a very loyal customer. And then we have another part. For those of you that are, that are looking at maybe generating extra income, part-time, or like myself, I wanted time freedom. I wanted to stay home. I wanted to start a family. I wanted to be my own boss. Where can you start a business for as little as $98? in Canada or 75 in the US. That unlocks a 25% savings on every order, full access to the compensation plan, and you're in business for yourself, but not by yourself. This was an, an excellent opportunity for me. And for those of you that are looking at something, even just a side gig to make an extra two to $500 a month, a thousand or more, because these products work and they impact people's lives, it's very simple to do. So. How to get started, become a member or a promoter, pick one of these health packs. If you're looking at optimal health, you can add some of the other uh, products to support brain function that we talked about this evening. But the breakfast solution is definitely one of the best places to start to fill those nutritional gaps in your diet. A vitamin pack a day and one protein shake a day is a great place to start to promote your brain function and cognitive health. Then there's our kids. You can't forget about our kids. I mean, my kids grew up on the products, the Vita Squares, the VitaGuard, taste great. They're like little, little candies without having any sugar or dye or artificial anything, or the liquid for babies before they can chew. The salmon oil plays such a big role in brain function and, and brain healing and recovery. And, and um, you know, when it comes to focusing and concentrating, kids need these products, especially when you see what they're eating and what they're not eating. That's what supplements do. Fill the gap as to what's missing in their diet. So again, if you or you know anybody that's looking at an opportunity or they want to help people and have an impact in people's lives, just take a look at what we're doing. Partner with us and you will impact people's lives. Again, if you just want to try the products, become a member. Curious about the income opportunity, just ask the person that invited you and we can sit and chat and share with you how that works. If you wanna learn more, just join us on our weekly calls. We, we kind of change up our topics every week to help people understand the different areas of nutrition and how we can support the body um, in, in many ways. So thank you for joining us tonight. I'll stop the recording and open up to any questions that you may have.